Dear pastors, God has a word for you. He's rebuilding the altar, but it begins with you. Let's talk about that. Hi, everyone. Welcome to Mana for Thought. Since COVID, there has been a breakaway from the church. But a greater breakaway is coming. So, pastors, God is saying that it's time for you to get it right. Because you've lost your faith, you are leading a faithless church. Without faith, you walk in darkness. You are leading God's people into darkness. The church, for you, has become a means of financial gain. God called and you answered a call that was not an easy task. He chose you. He called you to his people. The same way he gave Israel pastors according to his heart, which would feed them with knowledge and understanding. He called you to lead his people according to his heart and according to his mind. But do you have a heart? or a mind of Christ? Knowledge and understanding comes from the Spirit of the Most High God. He's saying to you, if I am not leading you, then what are you feeding my children? Because you're not being led by the Spirit, you are changing the trajectory of the church towards the world and not toward me, said the Lord. You have traded in the altar for the conventional ways, traded in the altar for your satisfaction and your will. God is saying, you need to repent. You need to repent and lead my people into repentance, saith the Lord. The altar is meant for sacrifices, a place of consecration. But your ego and your selfish ways are trampling upon that. Pastors, where are your rod and staff? You are supposed to be dependent on God, but you have forgotten what that looks like. God is saying, I am rebuilding the altar. But it begins with you. Rebuilding the altar will start with you and no one else. You are the leader the chosen pastor that he called. Pastors, God wants to revive the church, but the revival starts with you. Your dependency, it's not on man, but it's on God. So don't worry about who will leave or who will stay. God is your refuge. He is your strong tower. He is your defense. Pastors, there will be no revival until you repent. COVID did a number on the church, but you can withstand the test of time if you lead God's people into repentance. Don't send them to repent. Lead them into repentance. It starts with you. God is saying, Woe unto the pastors that destroy and scatter the sheep of my pasture. He is calling out to you, pastors. The people he sent you are your responsibility. If you are living a sinful, faithless life, you are imparting sinful, faithless ways unto his people. You are leading them into the hands of the devil. You are supposed to pull people to God from the pulpit, not push them away. Pastors, find yourself at the altar so that God can rebuild, revive, and restore the church. If you do not repent, the spiritual death and destruction of the people he placed in your care will be on you. If you continue to walk down the sinful and faithless path, this is a word for you from the living God.
I'm Alison Cornelius, and thank you for joining me on Mana for Thought.